another episode of Christina Rogers History Saver. Dana here. Howdy. <laughs> we are finally back at the 1700s farm field. The uh, foundation is right here um, in that midst of little bushes there. You weren't even in the shot. Well, part of my arm was. Oh. Um, and we were here, what, in January, February? Out in the woods back that way, sorry, that way, um, picking up those pieces of the sled. Uh, we will go back to that at some point this summer, but, <laughs> but we are so glad to be back, and I have no hat on. Uh. <laughs> Anyways, until the first hole, let's save some history. There. The target here. Pretty much surface fine. Yep. Uh, and is a surface fine. Right there. <clears throat> For a buggy, I'd say. I'd Most say likely. so. Probably not a step, but... Don't know what this is. But if anyone has seen something like this, that'd be nice to know. Please let us know. In a way, it looks like a step, the way it's curved right yeah. there. That, the hook thing is the one that's screwing me. Over um, with it, yeah. Maybe we'll be able to clean it off. Maybe there'll be a name on here or something. Anyways, gotta keep going. On to the next. Target! Birdies! I'm liking all this nice fresh air. Uh, my word for the past, it felt like probably it was a whole week. It's been a. Uh, Hot and humid. Activate. Back here in the wall. That makes sense why it was hitting here. Yeah. First. Holy cow. I, re I just hope that this is in the part to a newer machine. I doubt it. Just by looking at it so far. No, it's an old tool. That's an old tool. Could be a tool or... It's a tool, hun. Part of the... Steering. No, it's it's a tool. Could be a part of a steering or something, but no. No, it's a tool. To me, it looks like a closed-in wrench, but... Don't know, but we'll definitely get this cleaned up for sure to look at it more. But, sweet. Woohoo! Or it could have also been oxen. Oh. <laughs> or some part of the heavy duty tack. Or a bit, maybe. Or the piece that goes between the two oxen yeah, for the rope. Here, this end on the bigger end yeah. has that weird bend. Mm. Has the opposite bend in it. Yeah. So. Don't know. Someone might know. Mystery. Yeah, if anyone knows what this may be, that'd be nice to know. On to the next. What? No. And tuck it here. There. No. Ooh. I get close. Yeah. Careful. Oh, it's pokey. Hmm? 
either an oxen shoe or something Oops. like a horse shoe. <coughs> Part of a horseshoe. Sweet. Yeah, it has a nub right there. Yep. A nail? Oh. No, the actual nub. I mean, there's nubs. No, it's a nail. So, solid nubs on there. Maybe. Just maybe. <laughs> there, be careful. Do not hit it. Please don't hit it. Oh, oh. That's scary. <laughs> it's right there. I'm getting really scared right now. Why? Because this might be a good target. Well, let's hope it is. Okay. <clears throat> oh, it's right there. It's right there. Where's the edge of it? Right here. Oh, I know. I think it's a fork. Right here. Come on. Right there. I gotta, no, 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 no. I'm just trying yeah, to just get Yeah, just take the out dirt. the dirt behind it. Trying. Mm-hmm. Oh, my gosh. Hold on. We're going to check and see if there's any more of it live. Most likely. Oh my, oh my god. I know exactly what this is. <sighs> Guys. Yeah, it's a buckle. It's a shoe buckle. It's a shoe buckle. Are you sure it's a shoe buckle? Yes, I'm Double. sure. Big. I'm sure. I will show you. At this moment, I was explaining to him where I've seen frames just like this before. I have information from someone that's saying that it's late 1700s shoe buckle frame. My first one ever. I'm so excited. Guys, this is my... This is my very first shoe buckle or knee buckle frame. Oh my word, you guys, you have no idea how happy I am. I think they can tell. I'm sorry. <laughs> sorry. I will clean this up and we'll definitely, we're going to, we we got to get going, but we're definitely going to get pictures and we're going to just walk around very quickly to, not quickly, quickly, but <sighs> see if there's any more of this. Oh my gosh. My curse is over for sure. <laughs> Uh, on to the next. You got me wet. I told you the grass is wet. <laughs> on to the next. Another target here. Um, actually, I'm in the same area. Uh, the shoe buckle frame was right there. Came around. I didn't target, but it was a weird target. Got down to it. It's right here. Um, kind of wondering if this could be a cannon fragment or something like that, cannonball fragment or something. Um, I'll get it cleaned up, like I said. Uh, actually, I didn't really quite say. The homeowner's that this property was kind of only early 1800s. Well, probably like 1830s, 18, 1830s, 1840s. This whole property, including the foundation here. But last year, I found so many 1700s coins there. 
two over there. Uh, a lot of buttons. So I'm wondering if this could be a cannonball fragment. But there was no war around here. But I don't know. Definitely we'll get it cleaned up. I mean, it's round. It's very heavy. It's definitely iron. Um, definitely we'll get it cleaned up. But uh, this might be a good find. All right, guys, on to the next. Hey, everyone. I normally just show the hole, but I had to dig it up first. Um, I'm right by the cellar hole over here. I'm in front of it. The road is right here. Um, Pre-dug the hole. I haven't looked at it yet. So let's turn it around and see what we found. All right. It's in here. Sit out. Yep. Oh. Oh my goodness. Guys. Right here. Is it a coin? Or is it a button? Hold on, let me get a picture first. All right. Let's see what we found. We're gonna turn it over in three, two, one. And feel a shank, it's a button. Awesome, sweet. It's all there. Um, I'm gonna let it dry out, dry up, and then we'll clean it off. We'll see if there's anything on it. Maybe it's my first ever GW. Probably not. But uh, this cellar hole over here is actually from the 1700s. So it could be. Maybe. <sighs> first good find here besides the shoe buckle. Sweet. On to the next. Hey everyone, so that's going to be it for today. Um, we had an amazing day. Actually, two days. There was a two-part video. Um, but we found that one button and that old shoe buckle frame. Seven Late 1700s. I'm so happy about that, and I can't wait to see what else we find. So until next time, stay safe and save some history. Bye, guys.